today I'm going to show you how to make a chevron stitch and this will be number one because I want to show you several so I'm using a one size larger needle than what the yarn calls for this is a number four worsted yarn and I'm using a number 10 knitting needles and so but you can use the same number as what the yarn calls for if you wish it really it really looks the same but you know I like this look so what you want to do is have a multiple of 14 plus 2 so I have 14 and 14 that's 28 plus 2 one for each uh, side so if you want to make something flat like for like a table runner add two or three more stitches on the sides of garter to make garter so that it stays nice and flat but this is also nice like for a vest or a blouse okay so what you want to do on the first row is cast on your stitches and I cast it on 30 and the first row you purl so this would be the first row and all odd number rows you are going to purl so there's only two rows to repeat row number one and all odd number rows you purl and then all the even number rows will be the right side of your work so what you want to do is I am going to knit one and that's my edge stitch now the next one you're going to knit that one from the front and then turn your needle and pick that same stitch from the back so that is knit front and back so that is adding one stitch now I'm going to knit four one two three four now I will slide one as if to knit knit one and that one that you slid goes over that one now I am going to knit two stitches together and I will knit four one two three four the next one you knit front and back and that's where one repetition ends I have 14 stitches here the edge one plus 14 so we repeat the knit front and back of that stitch knit four one two three four slide one stitch knit one and that one that you slid goes over the last one now you're going to knit two stitches together and knit four one two three four the one before last you knit front and back and that's where the second repetition ends you can make another repetition and another and another but end with knit one or whatever amount of water stitches you need so this is the way it looks and it's very very pretty and I we will be doing other chevron stitches so this is not <laughs>